Hey everyone, this is Tim from Top Hat and Ears Food. Today, I'm back over at Popeyes and I'm gonna be reviewing some, let's see what that is right there, chicken tenders with some uh, sweet heat sauce. Here's their chicken tender. Uh, this is not a crispy or a fried, well it is fried, but it's not the crispy batter one like the chicken sandwich review that I did. But this is their blackened sandwich. All right, I'm saying sandwich. One take reviews, you know, one edit. No edit, you know, one shot. So this is their blackened fried. Has a little peppery, uh, what do you call it? Seasoning on it. So we're gonna try it by itself. And we're gonna try it with the ranch sauce, or the sweet heat sauce and see how it uh, tastes that way. Put that down right here. Like this, I wanna say that I am sorry, I don't have my hat on. I didn't have it in the car, so I decided to go ahead and just do the video as is. Also, if you like my videos, and you've been thinking about it or you like today's video, please hit that subscribe button. Give us a thumbs up. Hit the bell notification for future videos so you can be notified. Leave a comment below letting me know what foods you'd like me to review or if there's any food challenges you'd like me to try out. Now, I will say, I find this spicier. And I'm very shocked about this. A lot spicier than the uh, actual spicy chicken. Maybe it's all that pepper they add to it. I'm not sure. This is definitely a good piece of chicken. I was recommended by, by a friend of mine to try it out. I've never had this before, so I thought I'd give it a try. Now, these days, it's called the Blackened Chicken Tenders. But back in the day, it was known as, I found out while in store, the Naked Tenders. They said there's a, like a peppery season on it, then it's quickly uh, flash fried to temperature consistency, so it's safe to eat. And that's all I do, no bread, no coating, like the uh, spicier mild have. But like I said, or pepper for some reason has a stronger kick than the uh, spicy. So, if you really, really, really like spice, this is a uh, good tenor to try. So, I have a packet of that sweet heat sauce. So, open up and I'm gonna try the sauce by itself before combining it on the um, the chicken the tenders if you can see that oh my there's the sauce right there good nice little zing to it Let's add it to the uh Tender. Let's see what we get. All right. Now, I was informed by the store that. Well, sauce isn't. The chicken themselves is actually keto friendly. So if you're on a keto diet and you want something for Popeyes, the blackened is the way to go. The sauce itself, it is uh, spicy. It complements the blackened spicy, spices of the blackened chicken very, very well. And I do like the combo together. All right, being said, would I get this again? Surprisingly, yes. I think I'd like it at first because. 
What's a Popeye's tender without the uh, crust and the uh, sauce, you know? But it's a lot better than I thought it'd be. So, my review. On the chicken itself, for someone of my caliber who likes spice a lot, I would say that I'd give it an 8 out of 10 for flavor, spiciness, but I will admit, there's a lot more spice than full flavor, so if you're not a big spice person, this may not be one for you. If you like spice, I'd give it an 8 out of 10. Uh, the sauce, it is like a sweet and sour, if you want to call it, but it's a sweet and sour, it's like a sweet and hot sauce. Almost like a the spiciness of a uh, hot and sour soup, if you want to call it, from a local Chinese restaurant, I believe. But that's, uh, I would uh, rate the sauce a 6 out of 10. It could be spicier for me. But it's not super spicy. It has just enough tinge of spice. So if you want a little bit of spice to add to your food, it's a good way to go. Combine them together. Strangely enough, you don't taste as much spice in the chicken as you do when you combine them. It's a nice balance. So it may be a combination you might like. I'd rate it an 8.5. Almost a 9 out of 10 when you combine them together. So, this has been my review of... Popeyes, blackened, or as used to be known as naked tenders, with the This has been Tim from Top Hat and Ears Food. And if you like what you saw, please be sure to hit that subscribe button, hit that bell notification so you can be notified of future videos. Give us a thumb up, thumbs up if you liked it. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down and tell me what I could do better. If there's any food reviews or food challenges you'd like me to try, please let me know and I'll do my best to try each and every one of them for y'all. Again, this is Tim from Top Hat and Ears Food. And I am hoping that each and every one of y'all are having a blessed, wonderful, and magical day. Bye.